Hello, this is Terry Cole at Street East Ministry with another three things from the street. Um, today I'm going to be talking about re-earning trust. Um, trust is something that's given to you and if things go wrong it can be broken. Um, and today we're going to talk about three techniques that are important for reconnecting. So here we go. Number one, give the person some space. They're angry, they're mad, or you're mad, or you're angry. We've all seen that person who just won't let the two people separate. Got to say more, got to say more, got to try to reach resolution right now. Don't be that person. Give them space. It doesn't take a long time. It doesn't take a lot, of, but you should be out of sight and out of vision for at least a few minutes before you try to reconcile. So that's number one. Number two is talk about it as if it's in the past. Don't ask a person to relive it. Don't try to reshame them or don't try to, you know, do those types of things. Just talk about it as if it were in the past and ask questions. Do you remember when we were so mad at each other? What was going on then? Something like that. But don't ask them to relive it. Don't ask them to retell it. Those types of things. So that's number two. And number three is behaviors should have natural consequences. So if something is broken, don't replace it right away. Do without it. Um, if somebody takes something, you know, tell them they have to, um, they have to make up for it and, and pay back for it. That's a natural consequence, but make it about the behavior and not the person. Um, so those are my three things. Establish space of vision and audio for at least a little bit. And number two, don't ask people to relive it re-experience the problem just talk about how people were feeling or thinking and if they start reliving it just say hey let's not relive it just need to understand what was going on because here's what was going on in my head at that time and so on and then number three um go ahead and give natural consequences for things it's like well i understand but you were violent that means you have to sit out for three days and then we'll talk about how you're feeling then um, don't make promises about the future. Say, we'll talk about how you're feeling then. That's a natural consequence. We're gonna, you know, something awful has happened. We're gonna separate ourselves for a while and we will get back together and evaluate how we're feeling. So anyway, those are the three uh, things for reconnecting or reestablishing trust. I'm Kerry Cole at Street Youth Ministry. Bye.